The respiratory system is responsible for the movement of gases involved in cellular metabolism. Oxygen is used up and carbon dioxide is generated during the aerobic breakdown of glucose and other fuel molecules in order to produce ATP. Three important continuous physiological processes are responsible for the movement of oxygen and carbon dioxide. Ventilation moves gases in and out of the lungs. Gas exchange is the movement of gases into and out of the blood. Gas exchange occurs at the lungs and is called external respiration and at the tissues which is called internal respiration. Blood gases are transported throughout the body via the bloodstream. The pulmonary circulation transports the blood gases to the lungs while the systemic circulation carries them to the organs and tissues throughout the body. The process of bringing air into and out of the lungs is called ventilation. There are two phases of ventilation, inspiration, also referred to as inhalation, where the air is brought into the lungs through the airways, and expiration, also referred to as exhalation, where the air is moved out of the lungs. Proper ventilation is important to promote airflow, which enhances gas exchange. The movement of air is driven by pressure. A gas cylinder with a pressure gauge clearly illustrates the relationship between volume and pressure. Air will naturally flow from regions of high pressure to regions of low pressure. Pressure can be altered by changing the volume of the compartment.